What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another draw preview. And the ATP season continues on the grass with another ATP 500 event, the Hella Open, which is one of the biggest events on the tour for the grass court season. And this event is stacked. There are so many big names in this one, so many top 10 players playing, but some players have pulled out. So let's go to the withdrawals. Only the couple of players have pulled out. We've got Karina Buster. He's pulled out. Garen's pulled out. And also Kasper Rudd is out of this event. Starting at the top of the draw, we have eight seeds in this one, and nobody gets a bye in the first round. So Daniel Medvedev, here's a very tough opponent in the first round. Juan Leonard Struff, who's a very big hitter and actually likes playing on grass. So first round match for Medvedev. That's a big first round. Circle that one as one to watch. Winner of that match takes on either Pospisil or a qualifier in the second round. Then we've got Oja Eliassime takes on her catch. Another banger first round match. Winner of that match gets to take on either a qualifier or the number five seed, Roger Federer, who is the defending champion from two years ago. Then we've got the number three seed, Sasha Zverev. He takes on fellow countryman Kopfa in the first round. Winner of that match takes on either Umber or Query in the second round. Then we've got a qualifier versus Nishikori. Winner of that takes on either Korda or the number six seed and Wimbledon semi-finalist from 2019. Batista Ragu. So I told you this was going to be a stacked event, and we've got three top 10 guys in the top half of the draw. Medvedev, Federer, Zverev. They're the three guys that I'll be watching this week. I want to see how their games transition from the clay onto the grass courts. They are pretty good grass court players. We all know about Federer's grass court record, but Zverev's also pretty good on the grass. So I'm expecting big things from him, especially playing in front of his home crowd. And Medvedev, we know he hates playing on clay. How does he feel about playing on grass? Bottom half of the draw now, we've got the number seven seed, Goffin. He takes on Mute in the first round. Winner of that match takes on either Rodionov or the wild card Cole Schreiber in the second round. Then we've got Thompson versus another wild card Altmaier. Winner of that match takes on the Battle of the Russians, Hashinov versus the number four seed, Rublev, which is a very fun match to watch. Circle that one. Then we've got the eight seed, Monfils. He takes on Harris in the first round. Winner of that match takes on either Pella or a qualifier in the second round. Then we've got another qualifier versus Simon. Winner of that match takes on either another qualifier or the number two seed, Stefano Pass. So you thought the top half of the draw was stacked. The bottom half, just as stacked. Another couple of top 10 players, including Rublev, City Pass. Obviously, we're going to be watching them this week. Got to keep an eye on those guys. Interested to see how City Pass does because he's just made the final of the French Open and he's going to have to turn around and get onto the grass in a couple of days. So I don't know how he's going to do that. And obviously, Rublev as well. His game is probably suited to grass a little bit more than City Pass with his power. But I'm also interested to see how Monfils does because Monfils, we know, hits a hard ball as well. We haven't seen much of him since the restart. He hasn't had a great time since October last year. So maybe the grass court season where he turns his form around. So there it is. An absolutely stacked event. We have five top 10 players playing this event. It's insane. Uh, it's only a week long as well, so it's going to be a lot of tennis this week. No buys in the first round as well, so everyone's starting on Monday. Let me know down in the comments below. Who do you think is going to win this one? It is so hard to predict this one because Federer looks like the obvious choice, but he's in a very tough draw. He's got to play Medvedev, Zverev potentially to make the final, and then who knows, City Pass Rublev in the final. So let me know down in the comments below. Who do you think is going to win this one? So having a look at the draw, I think there's only a couple of players really have a good draw, and I think one of them is going to be Sasha Zverev, and that's who I'm going to pick to win this event. He just made the semi-finals of the French Open. He's in form and he does like playing on the grass courts. He's actually made the final here two years in a row, 2016, 2017. So he loves playing here. And of course, it's in front of his home crowd as well. So I think he'll get some energy off the crowd as well. So I'm going to go with Zverev to win this one. Let me know down in the comments below. Who are you picking for this stacked event? So the Hella Open, one of the biggest tournaments of the grass court season. And this year, it's absolutely stacked.